Up right here. So who did you need TV, right? Where are we? Type like of stuff for Hasden, right? And you are? Alhamdulillah, I go by the name of Muslim Bilal. Yeah, we're here, housed in Northwest London. London. You just, just come off stage, you know? I just come off stage. Alhamdulillah, it was a decent event. What's it called? Eid in the ends. I come from my ends to the ends. Spread my message. I'm the Will it be my daddy proud, but I'm gonna say to him, Can I go back to my house, mommy? I'm a Muslim. How's she gonna take it down? How they gonna take it in? Will I end up kicked out? Will I get a kick in? I don't know what to do. I've got to plan my next move. I wanna teach your hardest to but really gotta think it through. Now, if it's right for me, I've got to do. I live for me and not for you. I don't believe that it's true. The things I see in the news, it's my choice. I'm a choose. I ain't got nothing to lose. This is the religion of truth. Read the books, find the proof. It's middle king to me. Sit me down and say to me, What's the purpose in life? The just society. I was listening to the track, man. If you just break down what the track's about so people know, so they can catch it. Well, I performed on stage today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Basically, I tell a story. I feel like I've got a, a story to tell that maybe can inspire some youngsters about where I come from to where, where I've got to now and where I'm trying to get to, inshallah. So it's about I come from street life. Uh, Jamaican heritage, so life on an estate, not knowing what your purpose in life is, not knowing what you're living for. I come from there, that darkness, and now I feel like I'm at Islam, we're in a bit of a bad state, we need a bit of upliftment, we need a bit of inspiration, so that's what I talk about and where I'm trying to get to, Jannah, like or what things does it take for us to get to Jannah, so that's what so I kind of talk about the journey. Okay, so when you convert now, yeah. How did your family react? Because I've heard yeah. good stories, yeah. I've heard bad so stories. Basically, I told What's my, your story, bro? I tell my story. In my rap, I tell my story. My tell story from the streets to Islam. Uh, from everything to my first day in the match, did that was to tell him my mum, I'm a Muslim, and how she reacts. That's what's in my verse. How are they going to take it down? How are they going to take it in? Will I end up kicked out? Will I get a kick in? I don't know what to do. This is what I talk about. And um, What's the first thing your mum said? Alhamdulillah, my mum. I didn't tell her I was a Muslim straight away. I told her I was reading into Islam and she went, Yeah, 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 that sounds good, but you ain't gonna turn Muslim though. And I was like, nah, nah, nah. But the brother when I took my shahada said to me, don't tell your parents that you're a Muslim. You don't need to tell anyone you're a Muslim. Take your shahada, become a Muslim and just just practice. Within six months they'll find out that you're a Muslim when you know. Because at first they're gonna ask you questions, well, what's this, what's that? And you're not gonna know, then you're gonna start questioning yourself. Is this the right move I made? Should I be a Muslim? Should I not? So it's better and I did that. I didn't tell them at first. I used to be scared to say it. I used to be scared to pray in my house. Because I'm thinking yeah. my mum might call me and say something like Dinner or something, hello, dinner, 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 and I'm like praying, and she's gonna yeah. think, why am I not answering her, why am I blanking her, and she might bust in my room and see me standing up like this, I mean, what are you doing, come walk in front of me, what are you doing, what are you doing, and I'm just like, I can't break my, <laughs> so I was a bit shy to pray, and it's weird, you don't understand for a I told you that secret, I prayed my first few prayers in my bathroom, where the toilet is, I didn't have a clue, it shows you come from nothing, you don't know nothing, I was praying in the bathroom, in the toilet, because I'm thinking, my mama ain't gonna call me if I'm in the toilet, <laughs> I prayed in there, then prayers. But this is my first week of being a Muslim. And then I found out my first, I think it was my second study circle, there was like two places. Allah has made the whole place a match did for you, except for the graveyard and the toilet. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, wow. <laughs> They're going to make them up again. But alhamdulillah, my mum, she saw that I come to a beautiful place in my life. And, and she kind of, my sister, my whole family, they just love the way, they love the way I uh, I started handling situations like when something was a crisis in the household, I was still like, it don't matter, we can just see that like this. And then this when they started seeing the beauty in the religion and how the beautiful effect that the religion had on me, and it made them attracted to the religion as well. So your your family now they're more open to the deen. My mum took shahada and my sister took shahada as well. Allah Allah. Allah. Yeah. They both accepted Islam as their religion. Yeah. Yeah. religion. That's, that's wicked, bro. That's, that's one of them happy stories, bro. Yeah, that's yeah, one of the happy stories. I'm not going to keep you, right? But I know people want to hear a little 16 bars or a little freestyle if you want to drop, drop a little yeah. something. Uh, well,
You see it's cold outside, I got my coat on My mommy looked in my eyes and tell me hold on She said there's danger down the road that I walk on I know she walked on it before, now they're all gone Locked in the cage or down in the grave This is the outcome from the choices we made Alhamdulillah, I feel I've been saved Alhamdulillah, that's why I'm here today Saying, I'm a Muslim, I came from the streets to Islam They get on now when I see my brother give up arm Embrace with a hug and greet me with salam Salamu alaikum I'm a Muslim, I came from the streets to Islam They get on now when you see your brother give up arm Embrace with a hug and greet me with salam Salamu alaikum Jamaica is my background, London is my birthplace why didn't they teach me about religion in the first place? I was on the brink of walking around with a hurt face. It's a good thing I was into cool to read the first page. Amazing when I look up where I am today. This ain't what I was raised among, so calling this the chosen way. Yeah, I used to go into my church up on a Sunday where mom was cooking recipes, listening to reggae. Typical black boy, typical black household. Woke with my jeans low, face like I own a road. Before there was no hope, I used to make a lot of dough. But ask me about Islam or a love, I say I don't know. A few books, a few months, a lot of reading. A new season, it brings a new way of thinking I reason with a Muslim, he's speaking, I listen Smiling because of the beauty I find in his religion This is what was missing, the final piece of the puzzle So starting to make sense now, before it was all muddled I was stuck in the jungle, blind like a bat Now I see quite clear, it's a laugh fight for that Alhamdulillah Bra- Listen, salam alaykum, alaykum salam, I'll catch you next time Inshallah